Like, babe, it's not even that deep. It is deep. We're talking about our future here. Jeez, can you just call it with your future talks? Well, it's not, it's not like we can't avoid it. I mean, we can't avoid it, can we? Can we at least get to the bridge before we cross it? <sighs> Look, babe, Alex, I'm not trying to be pushy here. Right? But this is a conversation that we must have. No, no, I, I don't want to have this conversation. Not here, not now. Really? <sighs> oh, come on. Don't call me a crazy girl. Don't call me a crazy lady. To have seen this. Hey! It was as if they wanted to kill each other. Hey! Goodness! If you see the way they are shouting at each other, anyhow, ah, I even thought they wanted to fight physically. Yes, yeah, so writing my before before, <sighs> she wasn't even embarrassed one bit. If I was the one, I'd be so embarrassed there. Eh? <laughs> yes, I'd always known she wasn't the right person for him. Actually, I think they're great together. As a matter of fact, they look good as a couple. <laughs> I just... <laughs> uh, babe, please, let me call you back. Someone is at my door. <laughs> Hi. I came to return this. Hi. Thank you. You're welcome. Would you want to come in? No, no, I, I don't want to disturb you. I just came to... Well, I insist. Please come in. <sighs> okay. Um, since you're insisting. Sorry about what you saw earlier today. Um, what was that? Come on, you didn't see Alex and I arguing. Oh, really? That? No, I didn't see anything, honestly. <sighs> At least I feel less embarrassed now. Well, it's not all that embarrassing. Don't get me wrong, I mean, not that embarrassing. <sighs> all right, if you say so. Um. Where are your siblings, Teju and Tiwa? Oh, that. Um, they stepped out um, and they won't be coming back anytime soon, yeah. Okay, so you're home alone? Something like that, yes. Are you sure you're not bored? Now that you're here, <laughs> no, I'm not bored. <laughs> I think I disagree because I, mean, I, I find myself quite boring sometimes. Well, I'm not sure that's true. Trust me, it is true. <laughs> okay, can I at least get us a drink? Then we can figure out whether or not we're bored. How about that? All right, that works. <sighs> All right. This is a short love story of Linda Coker. A young girl that has coconut head and who wants to fall in love by force. Linda has forgotten that I am the universe. I see yesterday, I see today, and I see tomorrow. 
I mean, when I told Linda to relax her mind and not bother herself about having a boyfriend, she refused, but decided to throw herself at every fine boy. She comes across like a crayfish. Well, I understand. I understand. As much as I see the secret things of this world, I am limited by what I know when it concerns Linda. I'm not allowed to see anything that concerns Linda's love life and her family, which is why I can't seem to read this boy. And that includes Linda's secrets. Although after existing for millions of years, and witnessing the destiny of men, I do know for a fact that time is the provider of everything if people can just wait. If people can have faith and work their faith without getting blinded by their insatiable wants, desires, and emotions, everything, everything, that people wait for in faith will most likely come to pass. Well, let's hope that this boy is the one. Let's hope that he will not serve our dear Linda a hot breakfast at the end. Till then, may God save us from Wahala. So, <laughs> hold on for the last card and check up I win <laughs> yes I did <laughs> nice one high five high five you know I had to redeem myself after you beat me in Monopoly beat you you did beat me I wrecked you what are you talking about <laughs> <laughs> I totally agree, but there'll definitely be a rematch. Yeah? Oh, you're welcome. Anytime. <laughs> My pleasure. Thank you for this, Linda. I really enjoyed it. Drink, the company, everything. Thank you. It was my pleasure. Right. Really, I was having a very bad day. Mm. And all of this just made me feel better, honestly. Mm. I'm glad I could help. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, sometimes I feel like starting over. Starting over again? Yeah, yeah, starting over, you know, new place, new people, maybe a new neighbor. now oh. um i think i have to go now really yeah my name is this lady my name is this Stalin? Welcome, uh, um, young woman. Why are you here today? Aren't you supposed to know that already? Wow. It's Richmond's girlfriend. Do you think she can see you? That's not how it works. So how does it work? You have to tell me what I need to know. Then I'll tell it to the universe. That's how it works. Okay, um, so I need clarifications on some things. Mm. Um, I have this boyfriend. He's so sweet, mm. he's romantic, he's, um, he's nice. He's really good to me and he's crazy about me. Oh, I go love him. So, um, I, I like him. He's, 
I, I think he's the one and I really, really love him. Chai, Tian Ai is the one for her. They are meant for each other. <sighs> I think you should dump him. What? <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I'm not done telling you about him. What are you doing? I said they are meant to be together. Why are you telling her to dump him? Is everything all right with you? Yes, I think you should break up with him. For oh, why? I don't think they are compatible. He's too good for her, plus they are always fighting. Tell her the truth, please. See, the guy does not even like her anymore. So I am doing my favor, Seth. How do you know that? He told me. He told you he doesn't want her anymore? Those weren't his exact words. But I know he won't soon leave her. Tell me why you think she doesn't deserve him. I haven't told you about my second boyfriend. I told you so. She doesn't deserve him. She has another boyfriend. That is none of our business. Just let her know that the guy she spoke about already is the one for her. Hmm. Please, tell me more about your second boyfriend. Okay, um, he's, he's sweet, he's romantic, he's, you know, the thing, I think we are meant to be on different paths in life. I'm just not sure about him. I think you should go with the second guy. Um, maybe I should tell you about both of them and then the universe can tell me which one to go for. All right. Go with the second guy, please. Ah, Beggy, let her talk. And make sure you listen very well. Go ahead, please. Okay. Um, so, boyfriend A. Mm. Um, he's sweet, mm. he's tall, he's dark, he's handsome. Um, is he, he speaks well and um he's good in the sheets like he's a stallion in the sheets wow stallion in the sheet then what else do you want to hear again um he, he takes me on vacations uh he, he even cleared a space for me in his wardrobe to put some of my things when i come around um it makes me feel special <laughs> He doesn't make you feel special. I just think he is trying to control you. Which kind of enemy of progress are you like this? Um, I think he's just trying to make me comfortable. You think so? Yeah, make me comfortable. Anyway, um, boyfriend B is also romantic, he's cool, he's tall. But boyfriend A is taller than him. Mm. Um, you know, it's just a thing. I think we're meant to be on different paths in life. You know what? I think you should make it work with your boyfriend, B. The universe wants you both to be together for the rest of your life. Um, are you sure? Mm. No, go with boyfriend, A. Do not listen to her. I have never been more sure about anything in my life. All right. Mm. I'll do that then. All right. You should. Um, thank you. Thank you so much for your time. Oh, um, just um, mm -hmm. like this. Um, You're welcome. Yes. Uh, mm -hmm. All right. Don't forget to be ruthless. Don't show him any mercy. Even if he tries to beg you, make sure you stand your ground. The universe must really want me to break up with him. Exactly. Okay. Thank you. No be me. I am innocent. Hmm. Babes. Hey, I was so surprised when she walked in. Hey! Thank God she didn't even recognize me. Hmm? Maybe I shall told her to break up with the guy, Sha. Because that's not fair at all. She can't have two men at the same time. Yes. Maybe when she eventually breaks up with her, he will look at my side and see Road clearly. <laughs> ah, ah. 
I told her to break up with him as soon as possible. Ah, ah. Trust me now. I won't. How was work today? Well, work was pretty good. Interesting, nice. Must have been a really good day. Yes, I, I did have a good day. And what are you doing here sitting alone all by yourself? You know, I'm just here alone with my thoughts. Uh, let me just go inside, drop one or two things, oh, yeah, and sure. I'll come back, keep you company. Oh, no, that won't be necessary. Come back. No, don't bother. Don't, don't, don't Why? bother. Why? Let me bother. You've been needing someone's company now more than ever. Why would you say that? You know now. <laughs> eh? No you what? Know. Baby. Hey, love. Hi, food is ready. Do you want me to bring it? Are you going to come get it? Hmm. And what are you doing here? Sorry, I mean, what are you doing outside? Is Mosquito not going to bite you? Oh, yeah. Um, so I'm going back in. I just came to get my man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's go. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. as, uh, yeah, I'll you. see you. All mm -hmm. right, yeah, uh, see you. Uh. <sighs> My name is Susan. My name is Susan. As a matter of fact, she's right here with him, cooking for him and kissing him. Yeah, I don't even understand for this babe at all. She be she has another man. She should leave this one for you now. Wait and see. Uh, uh, I tell you, and if you see, eh, they are always fighting. I don't know why they will not just end it. Babe, you should tell him she has another man. Ah, uh, please, I cannot do that now. We will lose somehow. How about you don't tell him directly? Uh, how do I do that? You can tell her to bring her side boyfriend. Mm. And then you take their picture and send it anonymously to him. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, that can work. <laughs> Thank you for this idea, babies. Thank you. I got you. <laughs> You're my G. I got you. I T. <laughs> Hello, Sister Lynn. Oh, hi, Alex. Oh. How are you doing? I'm fine. Oh, that's good to know. Where's your boyfriend? I told you to bring him here today. You know, the universe has a lot to tell both of you. <laughs> He's actually on his way. Oh, really? It took a lot of convincing to get him Aww. here. He doesn't believe in stuff like Don't that. Don't worry. He'll believe soon. And did you break up with your boyfriend like I told you to do? Yeah. Oh. I do. Good morning. <laughs> That's good. You didn't take it so well. Really? Yeah. Don't worry. We'll get over it soon. <laughs> oh. Um, um, Sister Lynn. What? Do you mind not telling my boyfriend about the other boyfriend? Oh, I wouldn't do so. He doesn't need to know. Sister's code, Thank right? You. <laughs> what are you doing? What's best for all of us? Says who? You need to let me have this one. I think I deserve it. Okay, do what you like. Thank you. Oh. Hmm. Is he here already? No. Sir. Oh, I, I, I think he's here. Oh, that's yeah. good. That's good. Yeah, babe, come in. Babe? It's about to go Hello. down. <laughs> it's shut down. Don't call me a crazy girl. Don't call 
call me a crazy lady. I woke up like this. I was born like this. I can feel that you do. I can hear all you think here. I know you need a secret. I'll tell that you see. I got the universe. 